Are you guys ready for the most ridiculous unboxing ever? It's not even an unboxing. It's an unbagging. <laughs> I am not feeling well, so I might have some coughing fits, which I will stop the camera for. <sighs> yes, full-blown chest cold or whatever's going on. It's not just in my chest because this ear is starting to, like, be deaf <laughs> from the congestion. I did go out and get some medicine. So, hopefully, it won't last too much longer. I was going to sit here and open up my many packages of postage stamps. And I thought, while I'm doing that, why don't I turn the camera on and just chat with you guys and show you my stamps. Are you too excited about that? Come on, I know you are. You're going to see my stamps. <laughs> This is the kind of mood I'm in because I feel too sick to do much of anything else. I am still working on the Fabric Frenzy, which is tomorrow. But I thought I'd take a break. So glad my stamps came. I can print um, postage online, which I do, if, uh, if it's a package. But a lot of people order stuff that I can uh, send. I can't think straight. Send as what is called a flat and uh, letter size sometimes for very small things, mostly like for my penny auctions for eBay. And I can't print the postage for that on USPS, United States Postal Service. Maybe with some other program I could, but I'm not paying extra above and beyond the postage because some services you pay in order to be able to print, but I just have to pay the actual postage. And I can't do that, and I do a lot of flats. So I order a lot of stamps in various amounts, like $1 ones. They've actually made it easier with the most recent price increase. The additional ounce is uh, 15 cents instead of, I think it was 21. The additional ounce actually went down. And so 15, I don't have to deal with pennies and all that bullshit. 15s, 5s, 10s, that kind of stuff. And they all come, I opened one, and then I was like, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn my camera on, because I thought this was going to make for such an interesting video. <laughs> Each stamp comes with a cardboard in it, which I save, because Skylar and I use this for crafts and or games, things like that. So... That goes there for her trip this summer. We will have a whole bunch. And these are five cent stamps. They are grapes. And I'm gonna run out of memory on this card. Shit. Okay, we have enough time now. My mother's TV is so loud and her door is open, so I'm going to go shut that. All right, I think I'm ready for this fascinating video. But you know, there are people in other countries that might like to see our stamps in the U.S. of A. And again, five cent stamps are um, grapes. There might be some other different kinds of prints. This I cannot recycle, but I can throw it into a store that collects this kind of plastic. So it's going in a different bag. Next, where are my scissors? Come on, come on. I just... Right here. I went out and I went to Family Dollar really quick to get some expectorant. And they had some, surprisingly. And I picked up a whatchamacallit candy bar for my mother. I don't know if she's ever had that. She just said it was the best candy bar she's ever had in her life. And then I got her two cream horns. I'm, I have showed those before if you don't know what they are. It's just a pastry, a flaky pastry filled with cream. And then I also got her, oh no, I didn't, I don't think I got, I got her some bread. I didn't do a video. Before my trip, at some point, I bought her a little can of sour cream and onion Pringles. And I know it was before my trip because I put it with all her other stash of food and said, you know, if you have a hot dog one day, you could have some chips with that. But she's never touched them and I never mentioned it. And today when I came in from Family Dollar, she was sitting on her chair with that little can and she had the most serious look. She had just taken a bite. And I knew that look meant that she had found heaven in that can of Pringles. <laughs> she was like, 
I have never had anything so good in my life. We can get cans of this stuff? Um, <laughs> yes, Mom. I know she's had Pringles before, but maybe she forgot. Okay, these are $1 stamps. And I go through a lot of those, so I certainly hope I have more than one sheet. All I know is I spent over $157. Yes, I have another one here. And another cardboard. So excited about the cardboard. <laughs> so let's see how many I have. Oh, this is so this is so complicated. Plastic in one place. Cardboard in another place. Stamps in another place. Where's my list that came in this bag? I supposedly got three of the Patriotic Wave. So let's make sure I have three of those. And then I can mark it off. Ah, it's called Patriotic Wave. And I do indeed have three. I keep showing you upside down. I don't think you care. I don't think you're here to actually look at stamps, are you? You're here just to watch me. I know it. Okay, three sheets of $1. Got it. Let's cross that off. What's the other one that I did? The grapes. I'm supposed to have four sheets of grapes. So let's do that one. Grapes, grapes, one more, come on, come on, okay, now I'm confused, I'm supposed to have, maybe I have this, see I accidentally ripped this, five of the patriotic wave, oh, so I need two more like this, okay, I got them, let me get those out. So complicated. Bet you never thought it would be this complicated. What else can I talk about? I probably shouldn't talk about anything because I seem to be very distracted and not doing a good job at keeping track of what I'm doing. Anyway, so the Pringles were a hit. The sour cream and onion flavor, at least. And I only got the little tiny can because that's one thing... Uh, that I don't like in the house is any kind of potato chip and she's not a big potato chip person You never see me buying her potato chips. She's never asks for that And so I don't get them But I did get her that because I thought she'd eat it while I was gone, but she didn't so that little can has been in her junk drawer junk food drawer haunting me the other thing I don't like to have in the house is ice cream. That's why I like to buy her, like, novelties. Ice cream sandwiches or bars or whatever. That doesn't tempt me. But if there's a tub of ice cream there, you know, it's like I feel like I'm going to, you know, t take a walk in my sleep with a spoon and just, you know, so I don't like that. Okay, back to grapes. I'm supposed to have, okay, Patriotic Waves. I got five. Why am I so crooked? Because I can't line that up. Let me put a piece of tape there. <gasps> Handy dandy piece of tape. Like that. Okay, grapes. I'm supposed to have four. One, two, three. Uno mas. Uno mas. That's about all I know in Spanish. Oh my god. And that's only because my husband used to say that when it was time for his last beer. He'd say, uno mas. He'd have one more. And he'd announce it to me. Like I was like going to be happy. Your last one should have been like five beers ago. One more. So one. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm so happy I'm recording. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. How come we used to sing that? What the hell kind of stupid song was that? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will really show it, or surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. I don't know. There was more to that. <laughs> Aren't you sad that I don't remember? Um, what was the rest? I'm not asking you, because you can't answer me. <laughs> I'm dying. That's what I feel like. And I just went to my doctor, and I was going to say to him, you know, my throat is a little bit itchy, and I cough a little bit, but it was a very dry, little weak cough. And the next day, after my appointment, it started to come on, and now it's this. But he wouldn't do anything for this. He would just say, wait it out. He doesn't like to do antibiotics. 
I dropped some paper on the floor. I'm like a neat freak now. The old me would have left that on the floor until I moved out, and I would have still left it. <laughs> I'm going to look up if you're happy and you know it and see if I can get the next line. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. And then it goes down to, if you're happy and you know it, shout hooray. If you're happy and you know it, say ha ha. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh my goodness. Did we, did we finish the grapes? Come on, huh? One, two, three, four. Four sheets of grapes. Okay, let me cross those mofos out. Um, now we're going to do uh, the $2 stamps. I think I might only have two of those. Cardboard over there. Um, bum, bum, bum. Where are they? $2. I have two of them. So where's the other? The other motherfucker. It is here somewhere. It's right here. So we're doing good. Oh, cardboard there, plastic there, stamps there. So these are like this. Is that the Statue of Liberty? I don't even know. What is it called? Statue of Freedom. Is that the same as the Statue of Liberty? It doesn't look like the Statue of Liberty, does it? It's a fucking stamp. Okay, we're crossing those out. Can I start burping on this channel? <laughs> I'm a very good burper, especially when I used to drink. And I watch, you know, Miranda Sings, Colleen, Colleen Ballinger. She burps. I want that freedom. I want that freedom. I think it would be pushing it. A lot of people would think that was disgusting. <coughs> okay, let's do this guy. He is the uh, Eastern Tailed Blue FP. What's FP stand for? I don't know. But it's a butterfly. And he is worth 70 cents, I do believe. I got one. And there's 20 of them. And it was $14. So 10 would be $7. 20 is $14. So they are 70 cents. And what I do is, because they have changed, if they don't have the number on them, which these don't, is just a... Uh, like that. I write on it on the side 70 cents. So I will know that it's 70 cents for that. Okay, we got that one done. Oh my god, all of a sudden I'm hot. I think I might have a little bit of a fever. I was a little bit upset that my uh, medicine that I bought was alcohol free. I didn't notice that. I should have gone with NyQuil. <laughs> I would have enjoyed a, a drop of alcohol. Okay, we're going to do teapots. That looks like that's next. This is three cents, I do believe. Uh, silver coffee pot. Can't even tell. I know they're the three cent ones. It was only 60 cents for the whole sheet, so that's three cents. And how many did I get? I only got a couple because I want to use up the one cent stamps that I still have. So I got just one of these. And What's that? I don't remember ever getting that. All right, something different. Well, let's go look at these. Are the two cents there? Look at that big piece of cardboard for that little thing of stamps. I don't know. It's just very wasteful, I think. All the cardboard, all the plastic. These are the two cent stamps. And I have just one. Crossing that out. Pears. Where are the pears? Pairs are 10 cents, and I should have three sheets. Oh, here's one. They look like that. And two and three. So I'll chat while I'm opening these. Very excited for my frenzy tomorrow. Got a lot of new patrons yesterday. So happy about that. Thank you, new patrons, for joining. And I am going to... Um, just be excited. I have some new things that I'm doing, some some different smaller lots of fabric, and I, I just hope it goes good. I'm 
I'm in the mood for that because I it's mostly just sitting at the computer all day the first day and just uh, making sure that I don't oversell things because PayPal buttons I have people that buy all at once at first and if like I have uh, like six available of one thing and ten people jump on it uh, all at once and some people do within a matter of uh, less than a second apart it will let me sell oversell because it hasn't had time to think because the PayPal buttons are not that smart and then I have to refund people and I don't like to do that three of these guys crossing that out oh my god I'm so hot I'm glad you're with me right now, if you still are with me. Let's do the Uncle Sam's hat. These are 15 cents, and I'm supposed to have three of these. I use those a lot. One. Did I show you? Did you? Are you satisfied with my showing abilities? <laughs> on TV tonight. I usually have some kind of 2020. Well, I mean, there's always 2020, but it's not always something I like. I will check it out. Okay, I got my three of these. Lots of plastic, lots of cardboard. Okay, let's look at this guy. Henry James. I, I've not ever ordered this, but it must have been a value that I wanted. Okay, $17 for this one thing. They're 85 cents a piece? I don't even remember ordering that. Why would I have done that, I wonder? I guess I just went wild and got some 85 cent stamps. I feel so terrible. Bent cardboard, so sad. It's like, oh, look, it's got crinkle lines in it. I'm so sad. <laughs> these, oh, let me get rid of Henry James. And these are Uncle's, no, Uncle Sam's, I already did that one. Alzheimer's. And these are 65 cent stamps. Oh, I have to write 85 on these others because I'll never remember that. 85. And then these are a 65, and it's for Alzheimer's. Oh my god, I wish I was severely drugged. And that I could sleep. Okay, lots of plastic to recycle. And lots of cardboard for me and Skylar. She's got a bunch on her desk in her little container thingy. We will have so much fun making up games and using these. Or they could even be part of the marble run that we're supposed to make. I have all kinds of cardboard for a fantastic marble run. Expect that this summer. All right, you guys. Please do not overwhelm me with requests for more stamp unveilings. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. I laugh, I cough, and I, I pee a little sometimes. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. I don't feel good. This was nice. It was nice to just get in and just be silly and not care because I didn't care. And um, thank you for watching so much, and I will be back with more soon. Bye.